Hey everyone, I'm Vanessa. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I am a style and lifestyle blogger from San Francisco. Today I'm going to be sharing a new type of style video on my YouTube channel. It's going to be featuring my very first clothing haul, featuring some nasty gal items that I recently got in. Here is the package and I'm really excited to open it and share what's inside. First things first, time to open up the package. <laughs> the first item that I'm going to share today is this Janis Joplin graphic tee. I've been wanting a graphic tee for a while now. I know that they're super trendy, but I wanted to wait to get something that I actually identified with because I don't want to come off like a poser. I feel like a lot of times people wear rock bands and you know graphic tees that don't really resonate with them just because they're popular but it's just not my style if i wear something i definitely want to identify with it and i actually learned about janice joplin during a class that i took at san francisco state based on the counterculture revolution she was an amazing singer who had a tragic end and i just feel like it's more of a unique tee to wear I initially wanted to wear it as a dress, but I think it's a little bit too short to wear as a dress. So if I wanted to wear it as a dress, I'd probably have to size up to a medium or a large. I actually got this coin belt to match with it. Because the shirt is pretty boxy, I wanted this belt to kind of define my waist, which I probably could still do, but I would have to pair the shirt with a pair of biker shorts or leggings or some fun denim. Um, but this belt, I could even wear with today's outfit, which is a pair of light wash denim and a white bodysuit. We're actually going to shoot an outfit shot later, so I might end up using this today. Next up is this fuzzy green cardigan. It's super soft, and I feel like you can kind of see the texture on camera. I actually feel like this one could even go with the outfit that I have on today. I recently got in a dress and blazer in a similar shade of green and I feel like it's really flattering. It's almost like a lime or a minty green and this one is cropped. I feel like if you were going to a wedding or something, you could even pair this over a cocktail dress if you were to unbutton it. But it works equally as nice with denim and a white shirt. Next is this yellowish bodysuit. I feel like on camera it doesn't look as yellow as it does in person. Um, it's a very, very pale yellow. It does have adjustable straps in the back and these really cute button detailing. I like the ribbed fabric because it's nice and stretchy and I just feel like this is a really great basic to pair with anything in your closet, whether it's jeans or a skirt or some cute shorts for spring and summer. Next is this sweater, which is a turtleneck and a long sleeve, but there is a little party in the back. It has a little tie on both sides, which just adds really sexy detailing to a conservative front. I was thinking of pairing the turtleneck with these flowy shorts. They are kind of a more dressy fabric, but they're still stretchy. And I feel like the flowy fabric makes it a little bit more breathable. They have a little bit of a stretch and a zipper closure over here. And they're definitely more high-waisted. I would probably wear them up here. Um, and I just feel like it's a really nice dressy outfit that's kind of sexy for a date night, um, even in hotter weather because they're so flowy and breathable. The last item is this off-white fanny pack. I actually have a black fanny pack that I wear almost every single day. I use it every single time I walk my dog. I just love having my hands free when I'm walking her and I just feel like fanny packs are really convenient when you're on the go. This one is more of a chic style and it actually reminds me of a designer one. Um, I know that Gucci has a couple fanny packs and it almost gives me that kind of vibe. Um, it's more of like an off-white creamish tone and it has a V chevron in the front and I feel like you can actually fit a lot of stuff in here. That is all for today's haul video. Today I wanted to focus on explaining why I got each of the items and 
sort of my thought process on how I would style them when I wear them in real life. I hope that you found this video useful. I'm definitely going to link all the items that I mentioned today in the description below. Hopefully they're still in stock by the time this video is posted. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And if you wanna see more videos like this in the future, I would love to hear your feedback. But that is all for today and I will talk to you guys again soon. Goodbye. You're so fine, oh lady Let your body take control